overlooking the River Devon, we are at Sutton Hoo, where the burial mounds were discovered just before the Second World War broke out, and um, where the, the ancient King of East Anglia is thought to be buried, and tremendous treasure with him. We're looking at Mound 1, and most historians agree that this was the burial chamber for Ridewald. Ridewald, the King of East Anglia, was buried in the ship. It was He was a Christian, but he also kept an altar to the pagan gods. It, it were on the cusp of changing over, and it was at the peak of East Anglian, the East Anglian Kingdom, when this burial happened. We can discover about Ridewald from the Venerable Bede, who wrote about him. This large mound originally contained another ship. It has been rebuilt to represent its original size in the 7th century. We've just been talking to a young PhD student who's, who's using um, laser treatment to discover if there's anything, well, to see if there's anything more to discover underneath the mounds. And the technology is, is so advanced now that it's quite likely that they will discover new and interesting facts which he said should be available in about a year's time.